Hey, thanks. I'm here in Providence, Rhode Island at Level 2 for the Real World Las Vegas block party. Let's go catch up with some of the cast. This was the first time MTV has reunited an original cast from the real world. Now over, how do these scandalous housemates compare Reunited the Real World Vegas with their original season? It was hands down nothing compared to the first season. We were there five months the first time. We're two weeks this time. Yeah, we drank a little bit and got a little crazy. But that, that first five months, man, it was just like, it, it's all we knew. No, it was like 110% more fun. I wasn't over it. I wasn't even ready to leave. Honestly, I was like, you know what? I probably have about two weeks more in me. The two weeks felt so much longer the second time. I have to say, two weeks totally beat out five months. The first time, you know, you go on to something like that, you're just wide-eyed and bushy-tailed. It was a total different experience, but yeah, I learned so much. It was really cool. And over a span of five years since their original season, how have these cast members changed? I think Trishelle changed the most. Um, she was insecure in the beginning and stuff like that. Now she's just like a, a real kind of take charge kind of girl. Alton's the same uh, entrepreneurial spirit as he always was. He's out there making things happen. Frank is the same funny guy that they didn't give him credit for the first time around. I, I think I'm the same, uh, same moron I always was, which I think my mom's proud of. Well, Frank and Steven stayed the same pretty much. I mean, there were, Frank was definitely more like let loose and everything like that. I think he was like scared the first season. It's so sort of weird because normally people, if they have a second chance to do a show, they want to look better. But Frank's goal was to look worse. And so, goal accomplished, I guess. No matter what, an old dog or a young puppy is still a dog. You know, you're going to be what you are. And so, I think that everyone changed, everyone matured, everyone grew up. But at the same time, in essence, they were all exactly kind of what I remembered. You know, if they had issues, they're still dealing with issues. We're all human, all growing up. Looking back, these former housemates all shared memorable moments together. I had fun throwing Bryn the bachelorette party. It looked really lame on the show, I think. Like, everyone's like, ooh, yay, bachelorette. But she's married. Like, I can't, like, she's not going to be hooking up with dudes. The coolest time that I had the whole time I was there when we um, threw Austin's bachelor party at the Hardwood Suite. Just the guys just hanging out, playing basketball. With such a scandalous cast of housemates, what are the chances of these seven reuniting for another season? I don't think that they'll ever call us back. I think we're done, pretty much. I think Vegas is laid to rest now, and I'm happy with it. And, you know, I left the house feeling really good, and then when I watched the show, it was really, really cool to watch. Well, that's it from the Real World Las Vegas block party here in Providence, Rhode Island. Back to you guys in the studio. Steven, let's go. Thanks so much.